My name is Aaron. I, I'm a resident of West Lynn. Um, I'm Portland, Portland native. I uh, grew up in Lake Oswego. Uh, I'm married and I have four children. Well, because I have asthma, my, my wife um, strongly encouraged me to, to stay home. Uh, so in terms of the precautions that we were taking, we were not spending any time with any friends or family. And for the first time in three weeks, I spent, I had just spent some time over at my parents' house. Um, my mother has compromised health issues. So I was, I was concerned the following day when I had this sore throat um, that came on pretty strong that, that, you know, you start thinking, well, if I, what if I have COVID and what if I now exposed my, my mother to this? I just assumed this was going to be like any sort of virus or flu that I had received before. And when you're done, you kind of move on with your life. Um, about six weeks after testing positive, I continue to have some compromised uh, respiratory issues. I still am not, this has now been over three months now, and I still have not completely, um, I, I guess, bounced back. And so I actually have to wear a mask when I go outside, um, just even in, in open air, because for whatever reason, my lungs are hypersensitive to dust and pollen at this point in time. The, it, it seems like with COVID, there is a significant span and range of experiences that are people are people are having. And the challenge is, is that we really don't know if you get COVID, where are you gonna be in that range? Um, are you gonna get really, really sick? Um, are you gonna, is it gonna be relatively mild, but you're gonna have ongoing symptoms and I put myself in that category? Um, or is this gonna be like a blip and you're not even gonna know it? The challenge is we don't really know. We don't really know how you're going to react. We don't know. We don't know how you're going to respond. I do think that each of us, um, you know, there's a lot of debate about the wearing of masks, and this somehow takes away your rights um, by being forced to wear a mask. And you know, I consider I'm, I'm a I'm a religious person, and so you know, I I tend to live by the two great commandments, and um, so for me. You know, um, I think that each of us should want to help our community out by wearing masks. Like, it's, it's as simple as that.